of all means of transportation invented by human civilization, roads remain one of the most preferred. Roads are essential for economic development of any country. We as a country have second largest road, road network. More than 20,000 20, kilometers of roads pass through our protected areas or conservation corridors. Mary impacts on wildlife in India. Starting from direct deaths of the animals, roads act as a barriers, roads fragment our habitats and result in fragmentation and isolation of wildlife populations. So in fact, the roads, the road hits not only impact animals only, they impact on human life also. When we think about road ecology, it's not only talking about wildlife or about the conservation of species, it's also about protecting humans which die because of the collusion with animals on roads in India. Almost more than 350 people die because of road accidents daily in our country. In India alone, we have a lot of uh, such roads which pass through ec ecologically important and sensitive habitats. And one of these highways is the National Highway 7, which is now called the National Highway 44. This highway is a very important economic highway, which runs from the north of the country in Kashmir, uh, Srinagar, till uh, south of the country in Kanyakumari. Uh, it connects many different urban centers, rural areas and cities and it is a very important connecting link which uh, runs across the uh, country. A 30 km stretch of the highway passes through the Pench Tiger Reserves in Madhya Pradesh and Maharashtra, cutting the critical Kanha Pench and Kanha Navigonazira corridors which connect uh, source populations in the Pench Tiger Reserve to surrounding tiger reserves in the central Indian landscape, which is a very important landscape for long-term tiger conservation. Considering the importance of this corridor and the critical link it provides between, uh, within the central Indian tiger landscape, uh, many steps and litigations were taken by many conservation agencies and citizens to uh, prevent any damage from occurring to this critical link. As part of deliberations to avoid any kind of uh, adverse impact on this critical corridor, many different alternatives were suggested and one of them was an alternative road alignment which would leave the present road as a two-lane segment between sandwiched between two four-lane segments. However, this would lead to funneling of traffic and, two, and more and more traffic volume within the two-kilometer stretch which would create a bigger barrier for animal movement within these areas. Ultimately, many animal crossing structures were proposed in the entire uh, length of the road uh, cutting through the Pench Tiger Reserve in both Maharashtra and Madhya Pradesh states and construction of nine animal underpasses was completed in the Maharashtra section by the year 2018 end. During the first year of monitoring which we began in February 2019 till December 2019 we found a total of 18 different wild animal species using these structures with varying frequencies. These included large carnivores such as tigers, leopards, wild dogs, sloth bears and jackals, ungulates such as spotted deer, samba, gore, wild pigs and many small animals such as palm civets, small Indian civets, hare, jungle cat and the very rare rusty spotted cat. Some wild animals are getting habituated to these underpasses more than others. For example, here we see a pack of dolls using these structures uh, lying in a puddle of water, just as they would in their natural habitat. India as a country has shown commitment towards conservation. We have built world, world's largest underpasses. As on today, during the last one year of monitoring, more than 8,000 animal crossings across these crossing structures. This is just the beginning of new era of wildlife conservation in our country, and there are, there are miles to go before we sleep. Thank you.